all that so we'll react to uh, Jawai incident diplomatic as I mentioned in my earlier videos big fan of very well a big a huge huge fan of very well so I just did a Hemingway earlier now that it is slowly drying down I, I kind of like it okay now but this video is, is about an incident diplomatic but Joe I, and this again I think is a very well fragrance this it says woody earthy patchouli fresh spicy aromatic warm spicy citrus balsamic everything that I like and uh, the top notes of what like mandarin orange which I love Asian vetiver, Java vetiver, oil vetiver I love although I am familiar with the Indian vetiver nutmeg and the base notes of patchouli and sandalwood like all of these notes I think I like except for nutmeg I have not tried nutmeg let's uh, try this mm. Now this smells like a more refined vetiver and it, it, it kind of uh, smells like a barbershop type uh, vetiver. Oh man. Wow. There's something sensual about this man. This is amazing. Oh. I don't even know what I'm smelling, dude. Seriously, it's a it's a beautifully blended fragrance. I'm not even like vetiver is there. That is obvious, but it is such a beautifully blended fragrance. Okay, let's uh, try this. I, 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 I. Oh, I smell something boozy. I'm not sure what that is. It's probably that mandarin orange. There's a certain certain tang in this tang and this sort of booziness. I don't know. That's booziness. Yeah, it's a slight a tiny bit of booziness in this. I'm not sure what that is. But this is amazing. Wow. one of the best vertical fragrances that I've tried uh, there's something ambery as well something ambery and uh, tangy so many things coming to my mind it's like there, there's a certain gourmand aspect to it yeah like what I'm what I mean by boozy tangy and uh, whatnot it's it's it you know rum balls have you guys had rum balls for some reason it reminds me of that. I don't know what in this fragrance is, uh, is giving me that impression. 
yes robots funny I, I don't I don't see anything that that it, uh, even resembles anything like that in there but not right down remotely hmm it's a very interesting fragrance though I need to like give this a more try and then see oh, how much does it cost maybe I'll, I'll have to see how much it costs like oh, hold on for a minute I'll just go incident diplomatica so show sure, boy to forty dollars I guess hmm. it's a it's a it's a smooth bit of a it's not it's not like so here I'm having Hemingway which uh, which I'm which I'm finding it really, really beautiful as it dries down. Because in the opening, it was very harsh and very raw, very pungent, uh, essential, oily kind of vetiver. Now that it is drying down, it's it's beautiful. And this one, it's a bit smoky as well. It's a smooth and smoky uh, vetiver. So it's a bit smooth and smoky. Yeah, smooth and smoky. Uh, there's a certain tang to it as well. Um, and I don't know, boozy. It, it reminds me of a rum balls for whatever reason. I don't know. But I'm liking it. It's very interesting actually. So I, I, I don't think I've ever tried a vetiver that smells like this. It could be just my skin chemistry, I don't know. Two beautiful vetiver fragrances. Nice. Thanks a lot guys for watching this. I'll, I'll post more videos after giving it more beer and try.